What's going on, family? So this is a video I've been I've been wanting to do for a while, but didn't know how to start it or whatever. But uh, I just seen on a, on the news yesterday, I believe it was, that one of the Pacers got a fine for saying no homo in his press conference, right? So anyway, that's the that's the start off the topic. Then I wanted to show you this this thing I found. I work on the army base, so this thing is called, it's called, uh, the newspaper they have is called the Stars and Stripes, right? This is, uh, this is an article, had nothing to do with anything, it's just about education. There's an education guide. And this is how it looks. I don't know if you can see that. Wind is blowing, of course. Here it goes. It's a guy with tight freaking pants on, a girl's shirt on, and then on his book bag he has pretty much rainbow colors in his book bag. Look at that, man. That don't even make sense. Anyway, so I've seen that, and I'm just thinking to myself, what the heck is going on with this world? You know, when we see bulls and cows, right? A bull, you call it a bull, why? Because it has a penis and testicles. It does bull things. You see a cow, you call it a cow, why? It got nipples, it produces milk, and it has a vagina. You're not gonna call a cow a bull, or a bull a cow, right? So when you go to the doctors and, you're, and the woman's pregnant, you ever heard the doctor say, congratulations, you're having a homo. No, but we in our society, in our unnatural thinking, in our sinful thinking, we say people are born this way, and I'm not going to debate with anybody, this is just my belief, this is just how I think, again, I'm not here to convince anybody, but I got to make, I got to make a stance on my own channel at least, you know, for people to, to hopefully wake up see what's going on with this world you know animals have common sense enough to know that they if they have a testicle they're gonna do what animals with testicles do and if you got a vagina you're gonna do what animals with a vagina do but we as humans we born with a penis and testicles, but we want to act like we was born with a vagina, and vice versa. This thing is not natural, man. And uh, I could go into the Bible and ex explain what the Bible says about it, but you could find millions of videos on what what the Bible says. You could you could Google it. Nobody want to hear what the Bible says anyway. But I'm gonna put it. I'm gonna put those verses on this video just so for those who want to know what the Bible says about homosexuality and about living unnatural. So uh, that's what I believe. Again, to go on with, uh, with when you're having a baby, like I said, the doctor don't say, congratulations, you're having a homo or, or, or whatever. And now you can go to the store and go into the homo section and buy homo clothes and homo furniture for your little homo baby. That sounds crazy, don't it? But that's for how we live. That's how people live. So, I just want to do this short video. Just, I know no people ain't gonna like it, and that's cool. I'm not. I'm not here for the people to like me or or like what I think. I'm here for those few, those in, in, enlightened ones that that are woke to to see what our society has come to. To see how our society is is just getting worse. And it's only gonna get more worse until destruction happens, until, until the Father destroys this world and creates the new world. And I'm not talking about no new world order. I'm just talking about the new heaven, the new earth for, the, for his people, you know. This is just a test on earth. We just here as a test to live a legacy and a life, a righteous life for Yah, for the Father. And, uh, I know many people want to say it's hell on earth. Yeah, this is the hell. Like I always say, this is your hell if you're going to heaven, but it is your heaven if you're going to hell. It's up to you, it's a choice. Yes, we all sinful. 
but a few of us choose daily to try to live righteous. You know, we there's people that just want to live a sinful lifestyle, and then there's few that want to live a righteous lifestyle. We're not saying it's going to be perfect, but at the same time, you can't. What the church is teaching of love and grace and mercy and, and don't worry, just live liberal and do do what you want to do. How we live, how we learn in America and in, in a European culture, you know, whatever makes you happy, whatever feels good to you, you know, just do what you want to do. Like Nike, just do it. Don't worry about the consequences. Don't worry about anything. We only got one life to live. YOLO. Like Drake say, another homo. Anyway, uh, it also goes, you know, what you see on TV. I said this in my beard video, but you got a bunch of, bunch of, they put the guys on TV with sodomite faces or Roman Greek faces. If you don't know what that is, Google it. Pretty much a clean shaven face looking like a little boy or girl. And that's what they promote on TV, movies. They don't want men to look like men, you know. Why do men grow beards and mustache? Not to shave it off. That's my little spiel on uh, homosexuality. No, I don't agree with it. I don't condone it. I do believe it's sin. Sinful. A sinful lifestyle. It's an unnatural lifestyle. And um, that's just my stance, my belief. That's what you choose to do. That's how you choose to live. That's your prerogative. You know, I'm not here to judge. I know everybody says, uh, everybody want, nobody believe in the Bible, but they want to, right away they want to run to the Bible when it says, don't judge lest you be judged. And that's just talking about judging. When you go to court, what does the judge do? He sentences you to life in prison or five years in prison. He sentences you. I'm not here to give you a judgment as far as you're going to hell. I'm here telling you that the lifestyle you're choosing will lead you to hell if you continue in it so that's not judging people so don't get that twisted don't use scripture to condone what you do and don't use scripture to, to tell people to leave you alone even though you think you, you act like you want truth but when the truth comes you don't want to hear it but you don't hear me though all right family love you